Hi there, it's Anne from Anne Makes. Thanks for stopping by and welcome for those of you who are new. Uh, if you are new, please don't forget to subscribe by clicking on the subscribe button below or clicking on the Anne Makes in the bottom of your screen. And apparently there's a bell and if you click on that, you'll be notified every time I post a new video. So on this channel, I share, of course, a lot of store hauls, especially when it pertains to craft supplies and home decor items. Uh, that's what I'm all about and there's lots of DIYs and how to's here in for crafty things and yeah so if you don't want to miss anything subscribe so today I am sharing with you a Dollarama haul I have been to a few Dollaramas and Dollar Trees and other stores uh, lately and I have not had the time to film any video so uh, it's it, there's a lot for me to film and I am going to try to limit my videos to about 15 to 20 minutes. So that's what I'll do. I'm not gonna do it all together because the video will be way too long. So let's get started on this Dollarama haul. So on a recent trip to a Dollarama and as I'm pulling out the items, I'm noticing that this is a Dollarama that I go to less frequently, but I was in that neighborhood, so I stopped there to get a few items. And on my, I did have a list uh, uh, for things I wanted to pick up the next time I was at a Dollarama. And the first thing I wanted to get was this, the storage jars. You get five of these storage jars and this little cardboard thingy they are acrylic and they have this like little metal lid I like that they are very flat and they fit very nicely they are very um, space efficient and these are three dollars I already have one in my uh, stash here I wanted two more because I have a DIY storage idea for these and yes yeah, so look out for that that I will post uh, a video of that in the future I also was hoping and I was so happy to find these hoping to find the stamps the layering stamps that I've seen so many people haul and I found them so I got these layered stamp sets and these are two dollars and they are a very good value you get the sets all the set here of stamps to do a layered rose and you get three colors of ink they do not specify on the package what type of ink it is i will have to try it and to, to find out but it doesn't matter you can use the stamps with any kind of ink and at the back of the packaging, they show you how to create a beautiful rose using the layering technique. And they just show you step by step which stamp to use to create a beautiful rose. And in this kit, they're all $2, is the feather layering kit. And these are the three colors of ink it comes with. These are the stamps. Again, the technique is explained to you at the back. And then the next kit is to make the little owls. And these are the colors of ink that you get. And look how cute these little guys are. And they show two here on a branch if you want to put two. Aren't they cute? And finally, the fourth one that I saw, and I believe there's only four of these, four different kinds of sets. If there are others, I'm not aware of it. And this is the little birdcage bird with birdcage and little flowers. Very, very cute. And you have the three different colors of ink. I have seen other fellow YouTubers who are here in Canada because Dollarama is a chain of dollar plus stores that we have here in Canada uh, that have purchased 
these same stamp sets and uh, have even shown how they they've used them to make some some possible projects. So yeah, I, I look forward to playing with these. And I think for two dollars, these are an excellent deal. Very very good deal. So those. Then I got some more of these pom poms. See, I'm glad I went to this other Dollarama that I don't go to as often as mine because my store hasn't had pom poms in ages. So I got these little white ones, the little string of pom poms, and these are a dollar twenty-five. So they call it a pom pom garland. And you get, I think, four feet on here, or 1.25 meters. So I got two of those, and I got a pink one. Because these are the colors I like to use in my projects. Totally random, but necessary. I picked up this bottle of Lysol Hydrogen Peroxide Bathroom Cleaner. It says 0% bleach. It's new to me. I was new, I think, at the Dollaramas. And it says it doesn't have any bleach, but it's, um, it has peroxide. And these were $2.50, so I think that's a pretty good deal. I'm pretty sure it's more than that if I go to, if I go to Walmart or my grocery store, my local grocery store especially. And then I picked up the Clorox uh, cleanup bottle. And I like this because you don't waste anything. There's, this is the little tube that goes up to the spray part. And yeah, this is a good cleaner to have as well. So this one does have bleach and this one doesn't. So depending on the, the nastiness of the task at hand, <laughs> I can choose which one to use. And this is 250. And this one comes with 40% more. So you get a total of 700 milliliters. And in here you get, I think you have 500 milliliters. So you get a little bit less, but this one is new to me and I wanted to try it, so got that. So that is cleaning products, boring. <laughs> uh, in the kitchen section of this Dollarama, they had these salad paws. And see here it says grizzly paws. They're beautiful wood. They are like salad tongs, but they're, you know, instead of taking your hands, you take this. And these were $2.50, and I thought that's a really good price. Because uh, usually something like this, if you go to a kitchen supply store, you're going to pay more than that. So, yeah, got that for my kitchen. Back to the crafts here. I saw these cork sticks. You get quite a bit in here and that this is a dollar twenty five they're they're just cork so they're really really flimsy and thin and I just thought maybe there's some sort of DIY or home decor project that would be nice to do with these like maybe stick them around the base of a vase or a box just to have that that look and wrap some twine or something it's just very trendy now to use cork and twine and wood so uh i thought maybe i'll think of a project and this will be handy for that so i got them so you get oh it says you get 80 pieces in here and a dollar 25. i picked up a couple of these uh vine twines so they're like a little green wire and there's like pretty little foam flowers very delicate and I have, when I saw these and something else I hauled, I just had a, a home decor idea in mind, but I'm not sure it's going to work out, so I'm not seeing any more at this point. <laughs> so $1.25 for these, and you get about three feet in each package of these little wires. I didn't think it was a three feet. No, that's, that's more than I thought. So it's pretty good. $1.25. And I like these little uh, canvas packages. These are a good deal. You get four of these tiny little canvases. They are 
almost three by three, two, they're actually 2.78 inches, so almost three by three square, tiny canvases. And these are really fun for very small art projects. And they are $1.50. And you know, these are good for making little gifts. Uh, maybe, I don't know, maybe they're too big for pocket letters, I'm not sure. But uh, I bought a few packages of this, mainly because every year when I go to the show that I go to in January, the Association for Creative Industries show, that they call it Creativation, uh, in the olden days they called it CHA, um, the designers, of which I, I'm, I'm a designer member of, always participate in, a lot of us participate in this activity where we create individual small pieces of art and we anonymously, we do this anonymously, leave them lying around the show floor and the visitors um, get to find them and keep them. And it's just our way of showing our creativity and also sharing our creativity with uh, the public so and so we don't this is for money or fame or anything it's just something that we do to because uh, it's fun so I thought maybe I could use these for that event uh, next January and this was new to me and I picked it up. It's the Duck Brand Deco Tape. So it's, it's the, you know, the plasticky tape, not the paper or duct tape. So I just thought it was kind of cute. It might be nice for decorating on a project, a card, maybe in my planner. And I believe this was a dollar twenty-five. The price is not on here. I know the price was on the shelf, but I don't remember now if it was a dollar twenty-five or a dollar fifty. Now this is not a craft item, but uh, I thought it was handy to have. It is a double gated carabiner clip or carabiner carabiner clip for a dollar fifty, and it looks like a really sturdy one. It's all metal, and so you got the clip on this side and the clip on. Oops, you have a clip on this side and you have a clip on that side so you can hang things differently you can hang two things um, yeah so I got this for my husband to hang on to his gym bag for his water bottle and maybe the loofah sponge or other things that he clips to his uh, gym bag got that so a dollar fifty yeah dollar fifty so I think that's a good price for that and this is new to me. They have the Mitchum Dry Clear Control Antiperspirant Deodorant Spray for men. This is $4 at Dollarama. Um, I know that it's more, it's more expensive at the drugstore, so I picked it up, and I gonna see if um, my husband or my one of my boys likes it and if they like they really like it then I'll go back and get more got that now the other item I picked up I've never seen this at any other Dollarama so I don't know if it's new or if it's just something I've missed but they had these little bases and I, I'm just gonna show you quickly they're mirrored so they're mirrored little bases and they have these pretty little rhinestones. They're not too heavy. They are maybe maybe plastic or wood. They, they have some weight to them, but not too heavy. And they're $2 a piece and they're called candle holders. And I thought, yeah, these will, will look really, really pretty in my home because we do have a lot of crystals and silver and stuff like that in as accents. So I thought I would put my battery operated candles on these and put these in my home. And since I have four of those candles, I got four of these bases that are $2 a piece. 
I knew there was another item, but I was already looking at it, so I, I didn't remember where it was. I picked up this coloring book for adults. So it's a color your way to calm. And this is uh, a new thing at Dollarama because I see, I saw it at other Dollaramas and they were unboxing it at different places. And it's really, it's really cute. So it's a whole kit where you get 24 colors. You actually get, you actually have 12 pencils, but they are double-ended. So you have two colors per pencil. Sorry about the glare. And you have, it looks like a pretty decent sharpener. It looks like it's metal or it's a plastic and metal, but doesn't, it looks okay. Um, so you, yeah, that's where you get 24 colors out of 12 pencils. Very, very nice for traveling. And this is the set. So you get these coloring pages on a pad and you get this protective sheet to like either put in between your pages as you're coloring, sorry, in between your pages as you're coloring or just to cover your pages uh, for protecting them. And I chose this one, it's called Beautiful Places. And it is really for adults because it does have very uh, detailed designs such as this one. And I just wanna show you a, at the back the other sets that are available. I hope you can make that out there. You can see the other sets. You get Ocean Wonders, Animal Kingdom, Mandalas, Botanicals, um, Seasons, Island Breeze, sorry, uh, Escape to Calm, Beautiful Places, which is this one. And there's two others, butterflies and flower power. So those are the, there's uh, six different styles available. And some stores I noticed had all of them and some stores hadn't put them out yet. They were still in the boxes. So if this is something that interests you, uh, you may want to check that out. I think this is a great gift for someone, it's uh, a great purchase to make if you want to do some coloring on the go or coloring in front of the TV. So I'm just gonna show you, there's so many beautiful pictures in here. And you get scenes from many countries around the world. And you can get pages that say like Paris and Mexico and Italy, so. I just thought this was a nice purchase, makes a nice gift for someone who was getting into coloring. And the killer part is that this retailed for $18.98 in Canada. And of course, what's much cheaper in the US for $14.98. Uh, but you can get this and I I don't remember how much I paid for this, but I know it was not more than $4. It's possible that it was $3. And if I find the receipt, I'll put the price here. But for sure, this was not more than $4. So I think this is a really good buy at Dollarama. And there's two other things I want to show you. I saw this three-piece rain suit. So... Uh, and they show a golfer here golfing in the rain and my husband will do that so I got this for him to try it's just a three-piece plastic rain suit uh, it they did come in multiple and different sizes uh, this one says here universal extra large size I I don't know if this will fit him. Maybe this will be too small. Maybe it'll be too big. Maybe, you know, it'll be just right. Uh, it's a gamble that I took. And this, I know, was $4. So hopefully he will like it. So basically, it's just a clear vinyl jacket with the pants. And I think the hood is detachable. So you can wear this in a downpour, basically. <laughs> And, and stay dry. And finally, the last item I have to share with you is this kit. 
the darn yarn kit. It is in the Fashion Angels series, uh, a line created to attract uh, teens into the world of crafting. And this, this kit is Darn Yarn Infinity Scarf Kit. So basically it comes with this clear bag for portability and storage. It has a loom in it. Uh, some yarn and the pick tools that you need to do loom knitting and this was four dollars I'm gonna take it out here so it comes out like this it's very nicely presented um, makes for a great little gift and this is the little pouch it comes in so here you have the loom and you have the tools and Okay, there's two big holes at the bottom of the bag that are done, are made on purpose. I don't know how you're not going to lose your tools that way, but anyway. Um, the two little tools and the, the, the one that you need to lift up the yarn from the loom is in metal, so that is worth the $4 alone. This loom is worth the $4 alone. Uh, the yarn, well, that could be less, but seriously, $4, you can't beat that. And even if you're not going to give this to a teenager, you could learn to knit on a loom yourself with this. And I I bought this because I would pay $4 just to have an extra pick for my own looms. So that was my finds at Dollarama. I'm really pleased with what I found. Sometimes it's worth it to go out of my comfort zone to see what there is. And other areas. I hope you uh, enjoyed my haul and uh, please give this a thumbs up. Please like, please comment, please share and uh, take care of yourself. Stay crafty and I'll see you after the next video. Bye!